<laughs> All right, I'm gonna start the hood thrifting again. Of course, my battery's low, but that's good. I don't want to give you guys too much game. My name is DJ Motherfucking Still. www.beatologist.com. B E A T O L O G I S T dot com. And I'm at the rhodium, and I'll be fucking lazy doing the day after Melrose Trade and Post. I get up when I want. I got here late, and I'm about 9.43 L.A. time. I should have been here at 5 in the morning. That's where you get the real shit. But it's too much funny shit going on around me. So I'm going to let y'all experience some of the funny shit. You know, it's just two people calling me in the middle of my broadcast. I'm on my way, Pete. Now, what is she doing? You know what I'm saying? This lady just rolled up on me, like, doing something janky in front of my van. Oh, little. <laughs> All right. All right, we about to get up in here real fast. I'm going to show y'all <clears throat> some real shit. I ain't edited. I ain't picked up shit yet. But if y'all have any questions, let me know if y'all want me to pick y'all up some shit. We at the world famous Rhodium where a lot of the West Coast um, um, people got their start. You know what I mean? Um, easy E. If you guys want to really get in depth about the Rhodium, um, go to my boy Tony A's website and he can go in depth about how DJ Quick, um, Easy E, and most of the West Coast artists came up here. Rest in peace, Steve Yano. And they started their mixtapes up here. <clears throat> this is where I got my first skateboard, some of my first records, and all kind of shit. So, this is LA West Coast world history right here, baby. Uh, always lock your car, because this is some gangster shit over here. You know what I'm saying? Make sure your doors is locked. I got pickpocketed at this motherfucker, so. Y'all yeah, better have one of them. Now nah, I know why motherfuckers from the old school have wallets that have the chain on them. You know what I'm saying? I hope I didn't bury my chair like I usually do. Packed to the brim. Ah, fuck. You know? Ooh, low power mode. What's up? Coley, where's your beanie? I know I have to go get my beanie. Shouts out to Coley, my baby. Always looking out for her man. Fuck it, I hope Martin got a fucking chair. Coley, you want anything? Let me know. It's, it's actually pretty warm up here. You know, I sell clothes, but I never, you know, actually have the proper clothes I need. I love my Tommy jacket, but this motherfucker is too thin. All right, heading north. That's the screen area, that's towards the street. So, I'm going to the homie Martin. I don't feel like walking this whole market, but I will if you need me to. What's up, Kevin, DJ Extreme? It's all kind of dope DJ equipment up here, I'm telling you. Here, look, y'all remember these old school PVs? Y'all in the shop. Motherfuckers don't give a fuck up at this motherfucker and shit. Like, they act like how they drive up in Mexico. Like, no discretion. Especially the women. Y'all wrong. Here you go. Damn, I want to, like, get some shit like this and attach a cart on the back. That's beautiful. I know Coley wants stop. <clears throat> Look, I could be a king, a black king. I'm at the world famous Rhodium out in Gardena, California. I already see a bunch of cool shit in here, but I'm gonna go to the homie first. It's a bunch of cool shit in here. Barato. Barato. I think that means clothing. And then they got the good shit up here. Boom. And this is open every day, but I like coming on Mondays because that's when everybody go teeling. <laughs> I mean, that's when uh, a lot of the shit is gathered. Uh oh, motherfuckers in my pile already. No stealing. 
Hey. What's up, guys? Martin left already? Yeah. Ah, look at the um, that lamp is cool. Hey, what's up, man? How you doing? I got some records right there. Want to take a look at them? Um, yeah. Yeah. All right. I'll be right back, Martin. I'll be right back. Going on. Yeah, man. Really? Um, shit, it's up and down. You know, depending on you know yeah. when it is. Yeah, Damn, man. I have that same ashtray right there. On the yeah. yeah. He sold the signs. I bet you. Yeah, it comes with the with the display yeah. on. What's up, man? How much for the camel? Yeah, for me, man. You know, I always buy from you. Give me one second, Conrad. All right. $15. How much? $15. It's, it's, I'll take it. <laughs> I'm not going to argue with that. I got a matching ashtray now. It looks old. But I have another one just like this, but I don't have the top. You don't have this? No, but now I do. Oh, there you go. Hell yeah. And it's comfortable. Yep. No, he had the signs last week. I should have got the signs. I should have got the signs. See? Did you sell the signs? No. The, the um, camel and the Marlboro signs? You sold them? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. No, no, no. We, we take care of the tradition, no worry about it. I know what are you talking about. I don't know who he's talking to. Oh, I think he's on the phone. All right. Where'd he go? Here I come. I was wondering where you went. I don't know nothing about this shit. So you go through, look at this shit. I don't know. This is 70s and 80s and shit. I mean, I don't know what the fuck's in there. I don't know nothing about this. I'll let you know. Still do all that shit. Maybe an opera. I don't even know what to do with a bus. Commodore. This is a good one. Oh, the Rolling Stones. I mean, I mean, I heard of them, but not I'm like a '90s kid. You know what I mean? Like, like we don't. You know what I mean? Yeah, this is in cool condition. So, Spanish. This is Spanish. Spanish version. Oh, it's a Spanish shit. version of, yep, of the Rolling Stones. That's even rare, huh? And it has the damn thing. In the sleeve, so this is a good one. Ooh. So, that, they singing in Spanish then? No, uh, it's just uh, the Mexico it was version. released in oh, Mexico, okay, yeah. The Mexico, because you know every country on these big records they get um, releases in their country, and they yeah, get, yeah, yeah, and they yeah, get yeah. pressed in their country. Uh -huh. Okay, that's, that's I'm, I'm new to this. I'm in there now. Nah, know. no, I'm still learning. It's just so much, you know what I mean, to know about this yeah, stuff. Yeah, man, it's too much music genres and shit. You know, it's different. I heard of him, Elton John. Yeah, man. those are like dollar records. Yeah. Bruce Springsteen, that's cool. I'll put that in the box. All right, cool, thank you. Yeah, yeah. Oh, sorry about that. Crossroads, I remember that movie. That was a cool movie. I heard it was too. Yeah, that's okay, like $5, $10, depending on which one it is and what condition. It's a 
LP, the whole, the whole thing. Yep, but you got to make sure they all in there, yeah, too. Yeah, yeah. Let's see. Oh, it has the books. One, two, three, four. Yeah, it's all here, bro. Oh, uh, that's cool. Cause they, and they have, yep, the sleeves, everything in here. That's cool. Oh, it even has a little packet on it. The inner sleeve with the booklets. Yeah, yeah that's good, because usually that shit, <laughs> yeah, it'd be them. missing. Put them in their room and shit. Yep. Yeah. All right, thank you. Kendricks, that's a good album right there. Yeah. The Cotton I mean, Pickers. I don't even know, dude. Like, I mean, it's, it's probably worth about five, ten yeah, bucks. Yeah, not like a, bars, but I mean, no, that's a good, like, good, good yeah, music yeah, to yeah, listen yeah, to. Yeah, yeah. Most of the shit I like is cheap anyway. Yeah, yeah. But the stuff they looking for is like, like Rolling Stones, Grateful Dead, Beatles, oh, okay. and stuff like this. Mm -hmm. This is like lower end stuff. Yeah, yeah. Chicago and stuff, cause they made so many units that they yeah, ain't yeah. worth shit. The county records, nobody like them. Mm -hmm. Huey Lewis, this, I used to like that album, yeah. that shit. Oh. Man, I just took that out my crates. <laughs> Brian Adams. Teddy Pendergrass. Yeah, a lot of them are dollar records that I would have to sell for a dollar. You know what I mean? It's a couple of five dollar ones, a couple of ten dollar ones, you know what I mean? I mean you you know bars, I ain't trying to No, I'm that being honest, yeah, what I, mean, I can what, what I can what like can realistically do? sell them for. What can you do? I mean can you do a hundred for everything? Like fifty cents a regular less. I know you no, I'm, no, I'm just thinking, um, because yeah, yeah, yeah. like, it, it ain't like it's booming right now with yeah, records. Yeah, like clothing is really like my, I know. Yeah. yeah. No, clothing is because everybody wear clothing. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, yeah. With the records, you know, it's only a couple of us and shit now. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Is a hundred the lowest you can go and shit? Because I don't want to like beat you up over yeah. it and shit. I appreciate you bringing them to me and I want to help you out and shit. It's just, 80? um, that's fair. Cool. I'll do eighty. Yeah. You know, to help you out, man. Yeah. Nah, I mean, at least I think I can make my money back with 80 and shit. And I appreciate you calling, because I was like... Yeah, I didn't, I'm real, it's been a while. Probably... I know I have his number, let me fucking go through my phone. And I found it, mm -hmm. like, it's kind of early, let me talk, send a text. Yep. You know what I mean? If, no worries if you don't want it. You know nah, I appreciate it, man. Yeah. And yeah. I got your number now, so. Nah, hit me up any time, yeah, man. Yes, sir, you already know, bro. Where's your store at? I'll go downtown. In downtown LA. You don't even have to come down. Yeah, I'll downtown go. LA. Yep, you have any records or clothes, anything you think I could sell that the pop up? The, my main thing is Melrose. That's okay. what I do on Sunday. So I'll go check out your store and I see what kind of thing yeah. you got. And I, and I, yeah, yeah. I work or come get yeah, come down to Melrose too on okay. Sundays at Fairfax High School. Okay, hell yeah. That's a good movie right here. Yeah, that's, that's a good movie. <laughs> I, I study the soundtracks because I do film and television. Oh, okay. Yep. So that's yeah. how you you know all this stuff, huh? Cause I've been in music. I I was a DJ and shit. Now I like do a lot of film and television Ooh. stuff. I wish I had my dolly. Um, I'll take you. Where's your car? At? Um, you can. Can you drop it over where I met you? Oh, okay. Here you cool. go. Thank you. Thank you, boss. Appreciate it. Uh, let me see if I could carry. I don't think I could carry no, two. I'll carry both. All right, cool. Thank you. All right. Cool. I appreciate it, man. Yep. Dude, this is the shit. I'm mad though. Last week he had three signs. Oh yeah. It's just I was broke last week. Should I keep it real? You know what I mean? Man, with these times, I know it's tough. I ain't gonna lie to you, man. Yeah. 
That's what they can use to pay bills and shit. Oh, they got a Christmas tree? Martin always has good stuff. Wake up, Martin. All right, thank you, brother. Yeah. Appreciate it, man. Thanks for calling, man. Yeah, man. So, Petey. Nice Gordon, man. Gordon. Appreciate right, it, man. Yeah, hit me up, man. All right. All right, cool. Now I got to come to the bank. <laughs> hey, look at these, man. Look at this hair. Look at that. That's one in the top. Shit. Which one is that? What is that? Antina. Wow, but, but, but it gotta be a reissue because if Amoeba had it for 17, we gotta look exactly at- the same one. No, but I gotta show you the difference. I'm gonna teach you. Look at that. Uh... Look, you gotta look at the, this is how you could tell what precedent it is. This is called the imprint. Can you, you got glasses on. Can you see the imprint number? You guys know about this, the Ante New York? M P O uh, yeah. M M so, zero one thirty eight. We gotta type that in to make sure because if Amoeba had it for this, I really doubt that this is original. You know what I mean? But this is how you tell if it's original with the imprint number. Look at the condition. No, it's good. I hope to God it's original, but I don't think Amoeba will make a mistake like that. I, I really don't. This has to be a reissue. Yeah, this is from, uh, when they, they put it in a cell. Long time ago? Yeah, long time ago. Yeah, this is the, the long time ago, no now. All right, we gotta research that. Go on yeah. Discogs. I'm gonna show you how you how you research it. Go go, go on the internet and go on Discogs.com. And then we gonna type- Google? Uh, not a website. Okay. Yep, D-I-S-C. D-I. Um, S. C O G S Yep dot com yep go there I'm gonna teach you how to do records This is what I do every day Yep That's how you really research eBay is number two Discogs is number one yep. you know? Discogs.com No you gotta go not on um, eBay you got to go on the internet, like the website, uh -huh. like www.discogs.com. So we're looking to see if this is like a um, one thousand dollar record. That's Disco, crazy. Uh, what, what else? D I S G S. Okay. Dot com. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So you're gonna go accept. Then, then what you're gonna do? You're gonna search Discogs and you're gonna put in here. Put in the um, UPC oh, number, the barcode number. The number? Yep. Put that in right there. Just the numbers. Just the numbers. All of them? Yep. Six, all six. of them. Yep. Cause we gonna find out exactly what pressing this is. And if that thousand dollars, we need to go right now and no, put. The, one, no, we don't need. A, no, 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 no space. Is one number. Okay. Six, seven. 548. Okay, did not search? It came up. Yep, you could press search. Now go back down. Yep, now press um, right here. To the, yep, search. Hold on, I seen it. It's different. Six, six, seven, five, forty-eight. Six, seven, five, forty-eight. Six, seven. Zero, one. Uh -huh, eight. Three, uh, oh, one, four, eight. Three, one, eight. Cause I thought I seen it come up. There's something noise in this. All right, hold on, let me make sure. Uh, cancel. Okay, there it is. Six six seven 
Okay, hold Put on. It now we're going to do the, the other way. Just put in anti New York. Okay. Yep. Yep. Space New York. Mm -hmm. Is that it? Yes, too many. Okay, we're going to find out. Okay, all versions. Okay, that's it. Versions. Five. Germany CD 12 inch EP. Well, this is playing what it what is. Did the different it's versions. Okay. See a 61 for sale, they start at $3. All right, so we're going to find uh, out what's the difference. An LP? So put in that, that, that run out number. That number you can see. That's how we could tell what version it is. Mm, yeah, yep, that's how you guys look up. Yep. The Here's the numbers? Yep. Whatever. Whatever's on there. If it's letters, yeah. numbers. Letters too? Yep. Okay. <laughs> yeah, because it's really important um, what version it is. You know, it's a big difference between the original and the. Um, Reissue, but this look like a new amoeba to me if you ask me. But we gonna see. So we on Discogs.com. If you guys have any um, tape, CDs, or any type of media, you can go on discogs.com and find out the real value of stuff. And so we're just trying to see what version this record is, because my friend just looked it up and on eBay it's a thousand dollars. So we're going to see if that's this particular one or another um, version of it. Did it come up? No. All right. That's, that's the run out number? Gamma? Yeah, Gamma? Uh-huh. Uh-huh, B1. B, B, uh, point one. All right, hold on. We're going to look it up. Anti New York. With that run out number. You see G O M M A? You can see that? Yeah, right there. Damn, yeah, that's small as hell. Mm -hmm. B1. B1. All versions, anti New York. But that's just the CD. Oh, it's not LP? Versions okay. five, okay. Versions, CD. Tw okay, here it is. Twelve inch EP. Gamma. Okay, gamma. What number was it? Gamma fifteen or sixteen no, or 13. zero thirteen? Okay, double two compilation. So is it just one in here? Yeah. So it might be missing one. 